Hood, hood, rich, 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 hood, rich,
He definitely smoked me, my nigga. Bad too. Red punches, all that dumb shit. I'm a little nigga, nine years old. This nigga's a big nigga. Even right now, that nigga way bigger than me. That nigga was like six something, nigga. Big nigga. You know what I'm saying? I don't even know. But yeah, that nigga was with my little ass though. Off that. So boom, we're gonna spin the block, man. Turn around. So that was my first experience with a 38, right? Boom. It's a lot of experiences with a 38, but I can't talk about them shits, bro. I'm not trying to like bring no harm to myself, bring no charges to myself. You feel me? I'm just I just wanna tell y'all stories I can tell, you feel me? So boom. A lot of shit happens in within things leading up. I get a lot older. Boom, boom, boom. I'm probably in my higher teens now, maybe like 19 or something like that. Whatever the case may be, boom. 38 is circulating around the hood, you know what I'm saying? 38 is circulating. You know how that is. Everybody got hood guns and neighborhood guns and all that, boom, boom, boom. I had one of those, boom, I had possession of that, you know what I mean? And I was just enjoying that, doing my thing with that, hitting a little couple licks with it, doing, you know what I mean? Just regular shit that hood niggas do, I fell in love with it that way. But soon after I fell in love with that 38, bro, I realized, my nigga, I thought I was starting to think I was that nigga. You know what I mean? I was starting to think I was that nigga. Ah, boom, boom, I'm running down on shit, running down on shit, running down on shit, whatever. I, I'm having my way. Till, like I said, man, I ran into some shit, man. I ran into some shit, man. I ran into a nigga who was really a real grown adult nigga and really knew how to use that 38 for real, like for real, for real. When I say he knew how to use it, nigga, he got the drop on me, nigga, when I was supposed to be thinking I had the drop on him. But I'm going to tell you the whole story. Boom. I ain't going to tell you too much of the story because I don't even want niggas to know who I'm talking about. But niggas that's listening going to know who I'm talking about. But yeah. But R.I.P. to that, man. No, that nigga dead now. You know what I'm saying? But And I ain't had nothing to do with it. You feel me? But anyway, R.I.P. to that nigga, though. But yeah. Um. So before I even tell the story so niggas know it ain't disrespectful. But yeah. So um, whatever happened, happened. Ah, whatever the reason. I ain't going to even get into the reason why we was beefing. Biggs was beefing because of some shit. Boom. So now we argue. Boom, boom. After beefing for a little bit, blah, blah, we we our people might run into him. I don't got the grip on me at the time. You know what I'm saying? I don't got it on me. But we argue face to face. Boom. I spin off, go get the grip. You know what I'm saying? I come back outside looking for the nigga, looking like because I know what vicinity or what area he' supposed to be in. My nigga. By the time I like spin off and like try to like, oh, I get a good look at the nigga. I go to pull grip, my nigga. Shots is flying at me. This nigga hitting at me already. Boom, 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 boom. All six shots, nigga. It's hitting the car. I'm ducking behind, nigga. The glass window that I'm ducking behind, right, right, up, up, right. The shit right here. And I'm right here, nigga. Psh, glass windows getting shot out, nigga. I ain't gonna lie, nigga. Had to drop on me, nigga. I had to get low and get the fuck out of there, nigga. And niggas was with me too that lied about the situation, lied about the story, and how I really went down too, because a lot of niggas be capping. Niggas don't want to admit when we take an L and who else was there when we took an L. But yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. That situation happened, and I realized, nigga, how deadly a 38 could be. You really, you realize more how deadly a gun is, not when you on the end of it, running down on niggas, taking shit, but when a nigga got your life in his hands this close, and he know what he doing with that, with that 38, you know what I'm saying? With that 38 special, you know what I mean? But listen, man, I ain't even gonna keep this video too long, bro. I don't wanna get too deep into it, like I said, man. I don't want to talk too much. Ah, ah, Jimmy Gang, you know the vibes, man. We still out here in these streets, man. I don't want to be mad at me. I'm going out. See y'all in the next one. Jimmy Gang. Make sure you are subscribed. We drop content every single day. Story times, reactions, vlogs, uh, hood news. Talk about hip-hop topics. Everything, man. You get it right here. So subscribe, like the video, drop a comment. Let me know what your favorite gun is when you fell in love with it. You know what I'm saying? Tell me something in the comments. I'm gone. <laughs> Bye, have a beautiful time. All brown in my cup, no baby, don't sip no lean. Still popping them pills this year, trying to change some things. Never let the fuck niggas get you down to your purpose. Suicide of a pussy nigga, gotta know you're worth it. Stay focused on the money, boy, gotta keep working. All brown in my cup, no baby, don't sip no lean. Still popping them pills this year, trying to change some things. Never let the fuck niggas get you down to your purpose. Suicide of a pussy nigga, gotta know you're worth it. Stay focused on the money, boy, gotta keep working.